there's a new shingles vaccine coming to market and it looks to be awesome with just a little bit of awful. Stick around and I'll tell you more. So late in October, the Advisory Committee on Immunization Practices, the ACIP, which is part of the CDC, <coughs> uh, gave its recommendation to the new shingles vaccine, which will be sold under the name Shingrix. Uh, so this vaccine looks really good. So a lot of you know about the current shingles vaccine. And back when it came out a little over a decade ago, it was a big step forward because before that, we didn't have anything to reduce the attack rate from shingles. But with the, the one that came out 10 years ago, we could cut the attack rate in half. So that, that's pretty good, <clears throat> but it's not perfect because still half of people who were going to get shingles would get it anyway. So, and we also learned that the durability of its protection you know, was kind of okay, but it faded away after five or six years. So this new vaccine that's coming out, Shingrix, looks really good. Its protection is in the 90s percent. And <clears throat> as you get older, which is when the current vaccine really doesn't work all that well, the new vaccine retains that same 90 some percent protection. So shingles is going to substantially decrease with this new vaccine. So it's great. And it looks like it has good durability as well. So that's also going to be important. Um, what's the awful part? Yeah, there's a lot of side effects. Uh, arm pain is very common. You feel lousy after you get it. You know, you get body aches and some low-grade fevers. You just don't feel very good. So in this case, you're, you're going to pay for what you get. <coughs> uh, and you get to come back and do it again two months later. Uh, so it's a two-shot series. So it's got some downsides and side effects. But it looks to be great in terms of effectiveness, so I think this one's a big step forward. Um, so look for it to become available in pharmacies and doctor's offices, perhaps somewhere in the wintertime or next springtime. I uh, have no idea what it's going to cost or what insurance coverage will be like, but it's coming. <coughs> By the way, what's up with the name Shingles and what does that have to do with the roof of my house? Absolutely nothing. <coughs> so the name Shingles comes from the Latin word singula, which means a belt. And as a lot of you know, shingles will often attack wrapping around the chest or around the abdomen, sort of like a belt. Thus the name Singula, which gets sort of transliterated into shingles. Very interesting. <coughs> for more uh, videos, check out the website at sentinelprimarycare.com. And for Sentinel Primary Care in Briar Creek and Raleigh, I'm Dr. Patrick O'Connell.